As the storm raged outside, Mary sat curled up on her couch, her favorite book in her lap. She loved the sound of rain tapping against her windows and the way the lightning illuminated her living room, casting eerie shadows across the walls. But tonight, something felt off. The wind was stronger than usual, and the rain seemed to be coming down harder. Suddenly, there was a loud crash that made Mary jump out of her seat. She got up to investigate and found that her back door, which she'd left slightly ajar, had been flung open by the wind. Rain was pouring into her house, and leaves and debris littered her kitchen floor. But that wasn't what caught her attention. As she looked further into her living room, she saw three tiny, wet, and shivering baby deer huddled together in the corner. Mary gasped in surprise and shock. She'd never seen anything like it. She carefully approached the deer, trying not to scare them. As she got closer, she noticed that one of them had a cut on its leg. Mary knew she needed to help them. She quickly ran to grab some towels and warm blankets, which she used to gently dry and wrap up the deer. She then called a wildlife rescue center, but due to the storm, they said they couldn't come until morning. Mary spent the night tending to the deer, doing her best to keep them warm and dry. She felt a connection to them, and she knew she had to do everything she could to help them survive. As the sun began to rise, Mary heard a knock at her door. It was the wildlife rescue center. They came to take the deer away, and Mary watched as they loaded them into their truck. She felt a sense of sadness as she said goodbye, but also a sense of hope that they would be taken care of. Days later, Mary received a call from the Wildlife Rescue Center. They wanted to let her know that the baby deer were doing well and would soon be released back into the wild.